Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing my summer scalp care routine for maximum hair growth and I'd like to thank The Innate Life for sponsoring today's video. Healthy hair grows from the root so it's really important to make scalp care a top priority in your hair care routine and this is why I always include it as a priority in our growth challenges. And since the start of the summer growth challenge, some of you have asked me what the difference is between a scalp treatment and a hair mask. They can be very similar especially if they are both oil treatments but one thing to look for in a scalp treatment is stimulating ingredients. Scalp treatments are usually formulated to target issues like dandruff, hair loss, scalp irritation and of course to stimulate hair growth so looking for stimulated ingredients is really important and it's usually lighter weight ingredients as well hair masks are usually a thicker consistency even if they are oil treatments and they will use more heavy nourishing oils so things like coconut oil and shea butter are really common if you would like to use your scalp treatments and hair masks interchangeably you absolutely can but for the purposes of maximum hair growth i prefer to use treatments that are specifically formulated for my scalp on my scalp my current favorite is the rosemary scalp treatment from The Innate Life. Rosemary is a key ingredient in this treatment because it helps to improve circulation in the scalp and encourage cell turnover, which helps to improve hair growth and prevent hair loss. It also contains stimulating ingredients like castor oil, which helps to increase the overall hair thickness, and green tea, which helps to increase hair growth activity. When applying this treatment, I like to separate my hair so that I can apply it directly to my scalp. And you don't need a huge amount of oil, um, keep that in mind. It will make it easier to wash out if you just apply a light, even layer throughout. These front areas of my scalp are where I experience the most thinning, so I really take my time and spend extra time massaging these areas. And I like to give myself a nice deep scalp massage once I've applied the treatment to further stimulate my scalp and it's also so relaxing, it's my favorite part of my hair routine. The next step is to apply my hair mask and here I'm using the Innate Life Herbal Hair Mask and this is an oil based treatment as well but like I mentioned before it's a thicker consistency. This mask contains very nourishing ingredients like coconut oil, shea butter, sweet almond oil and argan oil that really help to boost shine and nourish the hair and it also contains slippery elm extract and marshmallow root extract which acts as a natural detangler so my hair is always really easy to manage after I use this mask and it's really easy to detangle. I focus this on my length and ends and again I don't use a whole lot because I don't need that much and then I like to comb my hair to evenly distribute all of the product I applied and this also helps to further stimulate the scalp. I let these treatments sit on my hair for at least one hour before washing them out as normal um, and then afterward this is what my hair looks like. I like to let my hair air dry and recently I've only been applying some spray leave-in conditioner after the shower and I like to apply my oil on dry hair. Here I'm using the Rose Hair Elixir from The Innate Life. You guys know how much I love this oil. It just works so well for my hair. It smells so good and contains over 15 organic oils such as rose auto essential oil, sea buckthorn oil, rose hip oil, and black cumin seed oil that really help to keep my hair nourished and soft in between washes and it helps to protect my hair from damage, it helps to reduce frizz, and of course it helps to keep it looking really shiny. I focus this on my ends and I like to use a little bit daily just to keep my hair looking shiny and fresh and of course to keep it protected. As always, I give my hair a quick little brush just to make sure everything is evenly distributed and these are the results. I love the way my hair looks. It feels nice and soft and healthy, but it still has volume and looks bouncy. The key with this routine, as with any, is to remain consistent. That is when you're going to see the best results. Um, I love doing this weekly. It's my favorite part of my self-care and doing this on a regular basis will really help you to retain maximum hair growth, especially over the summer months. Thank you guys so so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful and again thank you to The Innate Life for sponsoring today's video and I'll see you in the next one.